Hi, I'm Donna Cordova with the California Lottery at Mission San Jose High School in Fremont, showcasing the positive role you play in supporting California public schools. It looks like a traditional campus, but Fremont Unified is one of the top districts in the country in academics. Even with its 2,000 plus student enrollment figure, Mission San Jose High School proudly contributes to that success. We graduate 100% of our students um, each year. We have a high percentage heading off to four-year universities. Principal Zach Larson attributes that to dedicated teachers, counselors, administrators, and of course, students and their families. Our students are known for being um, extremely dedicated to their academics. You're thinking not about graduation, you're thinking about what college you're going to. Principal Larson knows that even with a solid track record, you can't assume students will come into school with that mindset. And even if they raise the bar on their self-achievement goals, the school must do what it can to help them succeed. That's where you come in. Thanks to the limited funding it receives from the California Lottery, Mission San Jose is able to help by throwing in a little more to help cover the costs of mandatory textbooks and some additional funding to help cover teacher salaries. Lottery funding was never meant to be the sole source of funding for California public schools. It comes to about one and a half percent. But let's look at what that little extra funding can do. Not every student loves taking Algebra 2 Trig or reading uh, Shakespeare but those are things that are required of the kids. But then if they're involved in an after-school music program or art or, or athletics, that keeps them engaged in the school. Those are some of the first programs often cut due to budget issues. Mission San Jose would not be exempt, but by using lottery funding to help cover more of the basics, it can help keep more of the extras alive. Student Jen Peg relies on his involvement in the school's award-winning student newspaper. Personally, there's never a time for me that has been um, or I've just like completely dreaded to go to school because there's always something to look forward to every day. You actually get to really um, meet a lot of new people, discover your interests, it's really fun. When you've reached the kids in some way, there's an even greater chance they'll succeed. Just as digital imaging instructor Donald Wee, he's received classical art training, however... This is the generation that grew up with computers, so they connect a lot closer to technology than with just paper and pencil. Many of today's teachers are also skilled at using technology. He can teach both, better increasing the odds that students will take something away from his classroom. This will be managed their own website in the future to create flyers for a presentation. Our students benefit from that and so you know it's very important that we have that so that we can attract the, the high quality uh, teachers who will contribute to the overall performance of the school district. That success stretches even beyond the classrooms, which Fremont City Council member Suzanne Chan sees as yet another positive for her community. Our, our school system is just so well known throughout the state, throughout the United States, that it is a big attraction for people. As attractive as possibly winning the lottery. In Fremont, this is your California Lottery News.